What's up internet this is Manish from rebellionrider.com and today in this quick and short oracle database tutorial we will see how to install oracle database 11g express edition release 2 also popularly known as oracle xe thanks to all my viewers and subscribers for your tremendous love and support and sorry for the interruption in sql joint tutorial series don't worry i'll be continue uploading the tutorials on sql joins right after this video it's just that people are asking for lightweight alternative for Oracle Enterprise Database and it's a very recent update from Oracle so I thought to do this installation video as soon as possible. You can read my Google Plus status to know more about Oracle XC 11G release too. You can also add me to your Google Plus circle, link is in the description box below. Ok without further ado let's start the installation. First go to oracle.com. Once you are here on the oracle.com just go to downloads. And in the database section, select Oracle Database 11G Express Edition. Once you are here on the Oracle Database Express Edition 11G Release 2 page, accept the license agreement and download the appropriate database file. If you are running 64-bit Windows machine, then go for this one. And if you are running 32-bit Windows machine, then go for this one. And if you want to install Oracle Database on Linux, then go for this one. As I'm going to install Oracle XE 11G release 2 on Windows 64-bit machine, I'll download this one. Just click over it. Now you need to sign in into Oracle using Oracle account. If you have one, then it's well and good. If you don't have one, you can create it it's totally free of cost. Okay. As soon as you hit sign in, your download will start. To save the file, I have already downloaded this file here. As you can see, it's compressed. We have to unzip this file. For that, just extract this file and uh, it may take time. I don't think it's gonna take much time. It's a very simple Oracle database version. Installation is very painless. You just need to click next, next, next and database is installed. Here is our software. As you can see we have our setup.exe right here. Just right click it and select run as administrator. As I have already told you that installation is quite easy. You just have to click next 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 and uh, Nothing much you have to do in the installation. Here is our installation wizard. Just click next. Accept the terms in the license agreement and then click next. Now if you want to install it in your C drive then you can just simply click next. Otherwise if you want to change the destination then just click browse and select your preferred destination. Just click next here. Here you have to give the password for your system user and sys user. I'll be giving Oracle here. Just click next. Our installation summary is here. As you can see, this is the path for our DB home and the HTTP port is 8080. You can change it afterward, but uh, for now, just click install. Installation might take some time, so I will fast forward this video just to make this video quick and short and easy to understand. And here we go just click finish and installation is complete. Now let's check just go to all program and here is the Oracle Database 11G Express Edition. You can either execute the SQL command line from here or if you want then you can go to your command prompt and then execute the SQL plus commands. Okay, let's check what is the SID or the global name of our database. As you can see our SID is XE, the another way of checking the SID is, oh sorry, sorry, sorry. 
here we go x e and let's check the version as you can see we have oracle database 11g express edition release 11.2.0.2.0 64-bit production and uh, several other versions are here that's all in the oracle xe installation to know more about what you will get with this oracle xe version just read out this status of mine on google plus and don't forget to follow me on google i regularly update my status on google plus with several tips and tricks on oracle database hope you guys enjoyed watching this video don't forget to give me thumbs up and subscribe to my channel that's it for today we'll see you soon this is manish